Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Estella's Recipe. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to press the subscribe button below to see more interesting recipes. Today, we're going to make a spicy braised chicken. I think the most popular Korean chicken cuisine is a deep fried one. However, most Koreans buy chicken from restaurant because it is too difficult to make it at home. On the other hand, spicy breast chicken is the one that you can cook at home easily. Also, it is much healthier for it is not fried. So if you're ready, let's get started. First of all, cut the potato into half and cut them into another half. If it is too big, cut them into three parts. Also, slice the carrot diagonally, but in a different direction. Try making a big chunk of vegetable, for it will disappear if it would be too small. Also, cut two onions into half and cut them into four pieces. Slice spring onion about 5 cm long. Wash 1100 grams of chicken with a running water. Put 3 mm of water in a medium heat. When they start to boil, put a chicken inside. Put two spoons of cooking wine. Put two spoons of soy sauce. Put a pinch of pepper. Put 150 millimeters of water inside the pot. Stir them together and boil them about 10 minutes. When it is done, drain the water inside and leave the chicken in a pot. Put 1 spoon of cooking wine. Put 2 spoons of soy sauce. Put 4 spoons of chili powder. Put 3 spoons of grind garlic. Put 6 spoons of red pepper paste. Put half spoon of pepper. Put two spoons of sesame. Put three spoons of cooking syrup.
Put two slices of ginger. Put half a cup of water inside and mix them very well. Pour a sauce on a chicken with 150 millimeters of water. And then, put a chopped potato, carrot, and onion. Close the lid and let them boil for 10 minutes. Afterwards, flip them upside down so that sauce will spread evenly. Stir them about 10 minutes and put a chopped spring onion that we have made before. Close the lid and let them simmer for another 10 minutes in a low heat. If you're not sure if it is done, poke the potato with a wooden chopstick. If wooden chopstick would go smoothly, you can turn off the heat. This is so good! Not only chicken but also sauce and vegetable inside really goes well with a steamed rice. Try making this at your home and share this with your family and friends. So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below. See you in the next video. Bye bye!